Hello folks, morning, afternoon or evening. Let's take a quick look at an integration between Tableau's and Cognos or just call it calling a Cognos report from a Tableau dashboard. We'll be going through the steps that I have mentioned here basically create a report to go through these sub steps here Tableau dashboard and so on. And here's a quick sample that I've already created. Uh, up here is my Tableau dashboard and uh, down here in my dashboard I have a Cognos report. When I click on any state, I will see some details on the particular state down here. Let's go ahead and take a look at how to do this. I'm going to first go create a Tableau or sorry, a Cognos report. Let me launch Report Studio. I'll use the Go Sales query. a list report. I'm just going to pull, pull in some uh, arbitrary values, inventory. I actually don't remember which one I had in the report. I've already extracted some data anyways. Doesn't matter. I'm one, not going to create the exact same one that I showed you. It's going to be slightly different. Let me go ahead and save this. I'm going to call it tab cognos. Okay. Actually, before I create the dashboard, let me go ahead and create a quick prompt for this report. Let me save this. Uh, make a note of you know what's the uh, text that we have within these question marks. We're going to need this uh, when we call the report from Tableau. Yeah, let me just quickly run it maybe for any one country. Say OK. Yep, whatever that value is. Let me go create a Tableau dashboard now. That's this version 9 that I have here. Connect to data. I'm just connecting to some Excel data that I have, which I had previously downloaded. Okay. I'm going to go create a quick visualization. Just make it look a little beautiful. A little. Make sure I create a quick dashboard. Bring in the web page object from here. Put it down here. Uh, I need to go to the properties of my Cognos report uh, from here. Uh, properties of my report and uh, grab the URL. just paste it I've already done it paste it in my favorite text editor and uh, also paste it down here there we go it's uh, prompting for the country now uh, and well there's probably no data for that particular country anyways so here's the URL here's what we need to do next couple of things go to the end of your URL you see where it says prompt equal to true you might get false and uh, now you need to pass the value from uh, Tableau to Cognos. For that, what you need to do is, uh, remember I had earlier told you that you need to remember the name of the parameter or the prompt. The name was country and you need to append P underscore to it. And the syntax of passing it is, uh, you know, ampersand or you know, that's just to add on to the URL ampersand. P country and then a year in decimal code you would pass on select choices select option here I have had coded it to USA uh, but instead of that you should use country which in my case is the uh, name of the variable or whatever it's called in Tableau country 
And another thing you need to do is, you know, uh, uh, do the URL encoding for your, uh, you know, for the country option that you're passing along. Once that's done, you paste it back towards the uh, end of your URL. I have got it here already. So just paste it towards the end here. And, uh, go back to my dashboard and uh, say dashboard actions. Create a new action. URL, paste this URL here. Uh, one other thing, I click select. So I'm gonna say okay. Let me close this guy off. This one too. Okay, now let's see if it works. Australia, there we go. That was your quick integration between uh, Tableau and Cognos uh, in Dashboard Actions. Go back here and uh, towards the end, you could, you know, it could either be in the end or just before you pass the parameter. Here you go. I uh, hope this was helpful. Uh, why would someone do this? Well, uh, well, I might do it if I had access to both Cognos and Tableau in my organization. Uh, of course, this is a very simple Tableau report, but if I had a much bigger Tableau report or a Cognos report, which is already created and, uh, you know, I, I didn't want to recreate it and it was, it was just a simple table, then I might call it from Tableau. But again, in case you plan to do it, here's how you need to integrate the two quite straightforward. Hope this has helped and uh, thank you very much for watching.